Hi, uh, I'd like to talk about this time about uh, free will. Uh, is it an illusion? Is it real? Um, and I've often thought about this, and it's a quite interesting question because you could say, uh, let me do a demonstration of why this might be possible. Let's see. So, if you say, let's say you accept the fact that if you do this event, X, it will lead to another event, which is Y, which is cause and effect. So, if X must have caused Y, then Y must be predetermined. So, if X happened, then Y has to happen. So, therefore, in, at least in that instance, we do not have free will. And if you think about it on a very small level, quantum mechanics might seem random, but we're not choosing those random patterns that make us who we are and what we do, and we are not all of those chemical reactions. We can choose to do, do something, but in reality, everything might just come down to being a machine, including your brain. Neuroscientists are starting to think that maybe you could unlock the key to whether free will is an illusion or not because you could figure out how the brain functions. Now what this really boils down to is whether you believe in determinism and that let's in, uh, in mathematics chaos theory that one event will cause an another, and that even the minute things, um, the very minute things will change everything, and that you can have a calculable outcome if you consider all of the, uh, the effects on the outcome, all of the input. Um, and so, if, let's say that if you... What is a good example? I could do something right now. And even 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 knowing, let's say I knew I I believed that my everything I did was predetermined, then I would know that then knowing that would affect how I acted, but it would still affect me on a determined course. Quantum mechanics might be random, even if it is, and I don't know. S Stephen Hawking said, in contrary to uh, Einstein, who said God does not play dice in regard to quantum mechanics, Stephen Hawking says uh, God uh, plays dice very often, and every once in a while he shows us why. And he, you really understand that that it, even random events will build up to what is going on right now. And that what you are doing is based upon a predetermined course. And this might seem negative in some ways, but I mean, is it really? Who's to say that ha not having free will is bad? Maybe, but maybe, the then again, the effect of thinking you have free will does affect ha your course, but it may still be determined. I'm not saying that I entirely agree that that is possible, but I, like... I entirely agree with it, but I do think it is very possible. Um, put your th thoughts in the comments. Uh, see you next time. Bye. Oh, also, uh, this is where I got those sources. Philosophy 101. Uh, you can probably find it online. It's a very good book. Uh, right, bye.